the climate is changing. What we build and what we finance can be part of the problem or part of the solution. $95 trillion must be mobilized for infrastructure in the next 15 years to meet development goals. Shifting finance towards low emission, resilient infrastructure cannot be done with today's planning, investment and financing systems. The OECD, UN Environment and the World Bank Group have joined forces to propose a transformative agenda that takes us beyond business as usual. It focuses on six key areas. Today, infrastructure accounts for 60% of emissions. The infrastructure we choose today will affect the planet for generations to come. Countries need to align current decisions with long-term climate plans, plans that only 10 countries have developed to date. Digitalization, new business models and technologies are opening new pathways, but only 10% of clean energy technologies are on track for market penetration. Governments must help move the next generation of climate solutions from the lab to the market. Countries are still hooked on fossil fuels. On average, rents from fossil fuels account for 8% of government revenue globally. Governments need to reduce reliance on such tax revenues and shift towards a more fiscally and environmentally sustainable future. The financial sector must evolve. Private capital from various sources will be necessary to fill the financing gap, but incentives favouring short-termism and undisclosed climate risks are holding it back. Multilateral development banks are an increasingly important source of climate finance, committing $35 billion in 2017. Clearer, stronger mandates could amplify their impact. 70% of us will live in cities by 2050, but city governments need the capacity and financing means to invest in sustainable urban forms. Only coordinated action across all of these areas will deliver the transformation required to meet the climate challenge.